Welcome to Measuring Angles. This is the video that you were supposed to have watched Friday, but of course it didn't work because I needed it to. So I'm going to help you with it again so you can redo what you were supposed to have done on Friday. Okay, when you measure angles, all you're doing is telling me the distance from one side of the angle to the other side of the angle. And you use a protractor to do that. It has the measurement marked in degrees. So let's count from one side to the other. Every 10 degrees is labeled. There's 10, from 9 to 100, that's 10, 20, 30, 40. So that angle measurement is 40 degrees. And if you think back to your elementary studies in, in angles, <clears throat> you had acute, right, obtuse, or straight. So which one would this be? It's acute. Why? Because it is less than 90 degrees. Okay, let's look at the next one. How far is it from one side to the other? From here to here. Now let's count. 10, 20, 30, 40. So that one is 40 degrees. Classify it. Acute, right, obtuse, or straight? Well, it's less than 90 degrees, so that would make it acute. Why? Because it is less than 90 degrees. Okay, the next one. Okay, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60 degrees. Is that acute, right, obtuse, or straight? It is another acute angle. Why is it labeled acute? Because it is less than 90 degrees. Next page on the back. And let's measure those. I'm going to zoom in just a little. Okay, count how far it is from one side to the other. Starting up here, or you can start down here. It doesn't matter. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. Okay, so there's 60 degrees from one side to the other. Is that acute, right, obtuse, or straight? It's an acute angle. Why? because it's less than 90 degrees. Okay, let's look at the next one. Okay, from here to here. This one is in between 70 and 80, so that would be at 75. So I don't want to start right there. I'm going to start where it's on a whole 10. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80. 85. Is that acute, right, obtuse, or straight? It's another acute angle. Why? Because it's less than 90 degrees. And when you look at it, this helps you determine that it, what classification is. You can tell by looking that opens up less than 90 degrees. Okay, next slide. On these, We have three different angles on one drawing. So you read the letters S, P, Q like a map. It tells you where to start, where to go to next, and where to stop. S, P, Q. Okay, so let's see how much it opens up. I'm going to erase that so you can see it. Ten. 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 110. So that opens up 110 degrees. Now we're supposed to look at QPR. So Q to P to R. 
notice that your vertex, which is where the corner is, is always the middle letter. Okay, so this angle, this side to this side, 10, 20, 30. That opens up 30 degrees. Now, let's look at the last one, S, P, R. S, P, R. Okay, so we're going to go all the way from this side to this side. Okay, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 110, 120, 130, 140, 140. Okay, now let's classify these. 110, is that acute, right, obtuse, or straight? That is an obtuse angle this time. Okay. How do you know it's obtuse? Because it's greater than 90. You compare everything to 90. Okay, the next one, 30, that is what? Acute. Why is it acute? Because it's less than 90. And this last one, obtuse. Why is it obtuse? Because it's greater than 90 degrees. Okay, let's look at the bottom one. Okay, we're gonna go from S to P to Q. S, P, Q. So let's count that. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90. This time, it ended up saying the same number that it's sitting on. Why did that happen? Because this is on zero. Let's look at it. This line right here is sitting on zero. So if we just follow that, we would see that it's 90 degrees. Now let's look at QPR. Q P, R. Okay. 10, 20, 30. 30 degrees. And the last one is S, P, R. S, P, R. I'm going to erase all this so we can see it. S, P, R. So 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 110, 120. Okay. Now let's decide if it's what is classification in 90. What do we call a 90 degree angle? It's a right angle. Why is it called right angle? Because it's equal to 90 degrees. It's exactly 90, what we've been comparing them to. Okay, 30 degrees, is that acute, right, obtuse, or straight? It is acute. Why is it acute? Because it's less than 90. And 120 is what? Obtuse. Why? Because it's greater than 90. Okay.